Hey everybody. It's Colin here from Steel Hyundai. I'm here with the 2022 Tucson. It's the Essential Edition, and I want to show you essentially what's going on with this thing. So let's go check it out. Come on. All right, everybody. First, we're going to talk about the redesign on the Tucson here because it's very impressive to me, and I really like the styling that they've taken here. So, as you can see, we've got a lot of bold lines all over the vehicle here, starting at the hood even, that goes down. We've got the mirror to match, and it goes around here, giving it a three-dimensional look. It really pops out at you. It's just bold, but it's uh, the fact that it's bold, it's, it's kind of funny because it, it complements the fact that it's aggressively safe, it's aggressively comfy, it's, it's all these things, but it does it in a bold way because it knows what it is. And that's a funny thing to say too because there's a lot of different trims with this vehicle but it knows what it is within each trim there this is the essential but there's also the preferred we also have the end line and of course the two ultimate versions which would be the luxury we have a hybrid there too so there's a ton that you can pick with this vehicle but that's just the outside here i'm going to show you the inside and remember this is just the essential version so it's really giving you just what you need and it really does a good job at it let's take a look inside all right, everybody, we're gonna check out the back seats here first. It's an SUV, you've probably got people in the back here if you're getting one, so let's take a look here. We've got the seat fairly far up at the moment, but ton of space back here. Uh, with just the one chair down, you can definitely get comfy back there. But the main focus here is just all the space. We have a nice height here in the back, so when you're storing anything, height's not really an issue. You've got a ton of space here, especially with the seats down, look at this. This is, uh, you know, you really need to camp out in a Tucson? Sure, go for it. I think you'd actually wake up feeling fresh. Not too bad. Now, this seat goes down too, of course, if you really got a bunch of stuff to haul. And, of course, you can also have a trailer if you really need to haul here, because the Tucson can do that as well. But uh, in terms of fitting big objects in the back, you should be, be having no problems with that. We even have a couple spots to tie down some objects here, so very convenient. In the back here, in the back here, come check this out. We even have a 12-volt outlet here. So you got power in the back and it's great stuff here. Got your donut tire in there, nice, easily accessible, no worries there. But let's get interesting with this thing now. Let's check out the front. Let's check it out. So as I mentioned, essential version here, and we still have a bunch of stuff, like lane keeping assist, everything like that, so a bunch of technology in here, so it's a base model, sure, we don't have leather seats or anything in this, but I mean, it's oozing with technology here. Got a touch screen, we've got uh, these knobs here, which are extremely intuitive to me, just, I mean, you're driving just up or down with the volume there, tuning the station there, incredibly easy. Um, I mean, as convenient or more to me, at least, uh, than the buttons on the wheel here, which are still great. You can access the entire menu from the wheel, uh, check anything out there. Uh, your lane assist is on here as well. You can even have a favorite button that you can change to the settings that you would want that button to be here. So it's, uh, it's also customizable. Very nice. We've got another outlet up here. We've got two USBs ready to go. We've got your, uh, your rear view camera here. You can actually... Uh, you can turn that on and off. So you can even have the camera on when you're going forward and drive. Uh, very impressive to me and not half bad at all. And of course, we've got our knobs here for your climate control. Everything is very uh, obvious on this. So that's what I like about it too. It's, uh, it's not trying to uh, impress you with the technology. It's trying to be helpful and it really is. Anyway, speaking of helpful, how does this thing do when it comes to getting from A to B? Let's check that out. It's time to go for a test drive. All right, everybody, so we're driving the Tucson now. We are on the road, and it's, uh, it's a really nice ride. Comfortable, um, it's a good ride height. Just took a nice turn, there was no body roll or anything there. Not like I'm going real fast here in sport mode or anything like that, but it's, uh, it's, uh, it's still comforting knowing that it can just handle these turns very well. For an SUV, it's, it's, uh, it's driving like I'm lower, that's for sure. But, uh, but I've got all the benefit of being able to clear anything there too, being an SUV. So it, uh, it's got both the sport and the utility of a sport utility vehicle. And of course, it is a vehicle, and a pretty good one at that too. The wheel feels, uh, feels very good to hold. It's just a, you know, you feel totally in control here, and, uh, and you're even in control of your, uh, 
of your media and everything there too. I've got my menu buttons, everything I can do from the wheel. It's quite nice. I'm enjoying this. This is the essential model too, so no uh, no uh, bells and whistles beyond belief here. It's just it's just the Tucson, and it's a it's a ride that knows what it is, and it's doing a good job at being itself. The results are in. I'm a fan. The essential model gives you everything you would essentially need with an SUV. The Tucson really is confident in what it can do and it does a good job providing that too. It's a very helpful vehicle in terms of going from A to B. It does it perfectly. It's not trying to impress me but it still does anyway. Not half bad. Anyway, I'd recommend coming out to check this redesign out. Stop by uh, Steel Hyundai there. I'm Colin Flanagan. We can go for a test drive anytime. Just give me a call and we can arrange something. We can take this thing out. It's a lot of fun. Highly recommend. So thanks for watching and have a great day. Bye bye.